What's going on guys, it's Flame, and welcome back to some more H1Z1 gameplay. Now, this is actually going to be a sort of quick video to look at the Misty Peak Dam. They actually done a big, well, yeah, I'd, I'd say a pretty big update that they've aptly named the Big Dam Update, which you've probably guessed it, the dam the Misty Peak Dam has actually had an overhaul. That's that's the main sort of thing I want to show off in this this quick video. I thought I'd I'd quickly just roll through a couple of things in the the latest update and stuff like that. I have actually played it before. Oh god, that deer scared me. I have played it through before. I actually played it a few hours after the patch released on the second of April, I believe. I'm currently recording this at well. I'm actually recording this on the, the 7th of April technically because it's, it's actually 5 to 1 in the morning I'm recording this, so it's pretty late, so if I'm kind of uh, whatever, that's why, and I apologise. But, any hoozle, any hoozle? Where'd that come from? I don't normally say any hoozle. YouTube, YouTube changes you, I think. I definitely think YouTube changes you, you say different things. But anyway, let's carry on. So, again, main thing is the big overhaul to Misty Peak Dam. A couple of other things are the zombies have had, well, I wouldn't say an overhaul, but their spawn rate has changed. Now, back on the second, when it first uh, actually released, the patch actually released, the zombie spawns were terrible. They actually meant to have it as if you're in a low population server there's going to be a lower spawn rate of zombies and if you're in the higher one obviously there's going to be higher they've also made it so that zombies would spawn near heat sources as they said so the more players that are in an area or the more gunshots and whatnot are firing off more zombies will spawn around that area so i thought that was pretty cool but it didn't work as planned on the uh, on the day of the update people were maybe seeing one or two zombies every couple of hours so that was kind of disappointing another thing is they've actually changed the face model and stuff of your character that's pretty cool I'll bring out my torch and what else oh yeah yeah you can also take off your your clothes and you can run around in your underwear so there we go that's interesting to see people running around like this go and friendly no don't shoot me I've lost my clothes where are my clothes I shouldn't have done that there they are Whew. there we go thank god now with the addition of the zombie tweaks of course comes new weapons well new weapon there is a new pistol can't remember the name of it I know that it takes nine millimeters it's a faster firing pistol than the M1911 but it does less damage of course because it's you know 9 millimeter what else is there oh yeah workbench so you actually now need a workbench to craft all your metal stuff so the likes of your metal sheets or crafting IEDs bear traps combat knives etc you will need a workbench and I think the workbench to actually make the workbench you need nails brackets, stakes and planks, I believe. Don't quote me on that. But I'm sure if you sort of footer with those in the discovery system you could probably get it. I haven't done it myself yet. I haven't explored much of this update and I'll be honest, I haven't played much of this game really in the past little while. It it kind of got boring to me, but the reason I'm sort of rolling these out is so I can have content coming out steadily for at least another week. Now you might be asking why another week? Well if you guys that like to keep up to date on when games release, you'll know that on the 14th of April, GTA 5 or Grand Theft Auto 5 releases on the PC. So I am definitely getting that and I will probably be rolling out a bit of gameplay for it. Quite a few bits of gameplay I'd, I'd imagine, especially because I've got a, a few friends that are getting it as well. So we'll get up to some shenanigans, doing heists and a lot of awesome stuff. So that's that's one of the main reasons I thought I'd, I'd throw out a H1Z1 video, just just to show that I am still going to be rolling out videos. I do realise I'm sort of just wandering around in the forest here as I chat to you, but what I'm going to be doing is I'm actually going to just explain the updates sort of to you first for a little bit, and on the way I'm going to collect all the stuff I need to um, to really survive and make it there. I'm probably not going to loot like all the towns and stuff I get to. I just want to get to the dam 
and and show it off a bit, which is nice. So I got to the the workbench. What else is there? Workbench. Um, zombies check. New weapon check. New animation check. Uh, oh yeah, you can actually now have you actually now have a face slot. So I'm assuming you could put your sunglasses there or your goggles or whatever, as well as having your hat and stuff like that, which is pretty nice. Pretty nice indeed. And oh yeah, yeah, just thinking about the hats as well. Zombies now actually wear the loot they have, so the likes of hats, and I think that's actually about it, really. Hats, I think. At the minute, I think it's just hats that it shows. Maybe there's other things as well. I wasn't really paying attention, to be honest. But they actually wear the stuff that they have on them. So if you see a zombie with a hat, you kill him, you'll end up getting that hat, which is pretty nice. I don't think they have it working for the the shirt and the trousers just yet. But I think that's that's most of it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna try and find my way to the dam. I'm not good with the directions. I have noticed though that in the bottom right you do have a position. So you do. And with that position you now actually have a hand drawn map as well, which is pretty nice. So that's cool. I'm at J seven. So if I literally want run west, I'll pretty much make it to the dam. But it's just a matter of trying to figure out where west is from here, which is going to be fun. But anyway, I will be back in a second, and if there's anything interesting along the way, I'll stop off, like something new or whatever, something that I think will be entertaining. So, here we go, back in a second. Well now, after realising that I've been going the completely wrong way, I find these little, little wood houses here on the outskirts at, at J10, and here we have, right on the shelves, a lovely recurve bow. So we're going to take that bad boy, and then, yeah, look at it, ah, uh, looks cool. And then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, I'm just going to carry on here on a chip day. Okay. That looks pretty cool. All that. Ooh! I've never actually had an AR-15 in this, I can't bring out... What's going on? Inventory? Inven inven inventory? Really? Really? Come on, inventory. God damn it. Tab. Oh, Alright, there we go. So, Steam Overlay was being a little bitch. But, look! <gasps> AR-15! Yeah! Look at that! Again, I've never had one before. I have never had an AR-15 before in this game. Right enough, I don't play it that often. But look at that, everyone round for it. Oh yeah. One round. That's right. What rounds does it take? I think it takes the... Oh, it's actually got it chambered. Don't know what round it takes, but that's cool. Oh. Oh yeah, I think it takes that. Let's see. It does. Oh yeah. This is. This, I, I, I've noticed this too. This is new here as well. You're able to rest on beds and stuff. I think it allows you to sprint for longer without your stamina going down, which is pretty cool, I guess. But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna rest up and actually get back on course to where I need to go. Hopefully in the right direction. Oh yeah, weapons that also appear on your back and stuff as well. That's pretty cool. Let's see, can we put the bow away? <laughs> oh, nice. That looks pretty cool. Look at me. Okay, finally made it. And it actually looks like someone has set up a shop here already. So, oh, there's a zombie. So, that's leading me to believe that the loot's quite, quite good. But I'm not really here for loot. I just want to check it out, and see what it all looks like. So all of this is is pretty much the same. Oh wow! Shit, they wow. Okay. They mean business. Ooh. Look at that. There we go. Misty peak down. Here we are. Right. Let's see. If we can get away with checking this place out without being disturbed. 
so I think actually that there a bit I think is no, that's not you I don't think been a while since I was here but to tell the truth I haven't really played this game that much to really be familiar with everything but here we go that's new over there in the distance these aren't you okay I'm actually very dehydrated at the minute so yeah, that's a problem but this is the big thing down here as you can see that's that's the big dam eh? yeah so how do we get down there must be a ladder or something or stairs ah here we go here we go so we'll check this out see if we can find anything probably find someone that looks have to go this way okay not bad oh, there we go that, that looks pretty cool a lot went into it here's hoping they actually got the the loot spawn set that'll be nice oh just a random pipe here. Ah, oh, we've got a player base there as well. So this is going to be interesting. I don't know what that is. Oh, rabbit traps, okay. This will be interesting. Hopefully I can go through here without being being disturbed. Because I just want to check stuff out. I just want to check stuff out. So let's see, let's have a nose in here. Pipes. More pipes. Pipes, pipes, pipes. Okay. Crowbar. Right, that makes sense. That makes sense. There'll be loads of pipes where there's pipes. So there we go. Pipe room. Okay. Uh, ooh. Do we have here anything here? Let's see what we can find in here. Now we're finally here. There has to be some stuff here has to be. Unless they've already looted it. Ooh, wow. Look at that. Shit. Okay. More pipes. Pipes, pipe, pipes. Hmm. Loots of pipes. I do have a, a feeling that people have already looted. Or this place is just going to be good for the likes of getting metal and stuff. Which seems likely. This is only one part though. We'll, we'll explore the rest. But it is cool. There's definitely a lot of work into it. It's nice that there... I, I'd like to see more areas. But it's, it is pretty awesome that they've added to the dam. It is pretty good. It's a big dam. Yeah, yeah. I see what they done there with naming it. I see. Right, let's carry on. Right. Going up to the last building on this, this ground bit here. Some cars and stuff. Let's check the car, or the truck, right of interest. Just tarp, usual stuff that you'd get. Okay. It's this. Yeah, it's. Well, not really the same layout, but it's got the same stuff in it. So I'm assuming we're just going to find a bunch of pipes and whatnot. Which is okay. I mean, I came here to, to really just show it off. Not to not to expect fat loots, really. But I'm here now. I've, I, can, I can say I've checked out the new Misty Peak Big Dam. It's a, it's not a little thing. Yeah, there's a bunch of pipes as well. Okay then. Well, that's that's not bad. Oh. I probably might have been able to find might have been able to find the new pistol, but as I said, I just I just really wanted to get here to check it out. See what see what's up. Wow. It's actually very, very bright outside for night time. Okay. Uh, I know there's another bit up there, so I'm gonna I'm actually going to look, well, looks like I'm going to take the long way and go all the way around. And we'll check up there, and that'll probably do for this video. So, see you in a second. Actually, just coming up along this road, I'll notice there's more buildings down here, so... Let's check these ones out. That worries me. 
That definitely worries me. But what can you do? Nothing. Alright. So, by the looks, these are just going to be your normal sort of. Ah, no. Right, that. What was that? That bit across the bridge isn't you. Did I just phase through that or did I go through that gap? That was lucky. Oh, people are. I don't know if players have put those there or not. But. I'm hearing things. I think I'm hearing things. So that bit over there, that there's not you. But this bit here, this this addition here, I believe is new. But again, I don't think we're going to find any spectacular loot. To be honest, just, just junk, really. Metal and the likes. But it's okay. It's okay. As I said, just here checking it out. Ah, this building's familiar. It actually looks like I'm gonna gonna dehydrate anyway. So that's fun. We'll have a quick look through all these filing cabinets and stuff. There might be some goodies. Multivitamins? Nah, no thanks. So I'm dehydrated dehydrated now, I can't actually sprint anymore, but that's okay. Round coffee. More forty five rounds. Great. If only I had the gun. Uh actually I tell you what, I've got no I don't. I thought I had stagnant water there, but I don't. I don't. Oh. Nine millimeter rounds. Cool. No gun though. Well that sucks. But anyway, oh ow. That's pretty much it. That is actually pretty much it. There is another sort of dam area up here. Tell you what, we'll, we'll head there. We'll head there before I die. Alright, here we go. This is it. This is the next bit. More pipes and whatnot. It's nice. But that's the main dam. So it is. That's the main dam area. As you can see, I am dying of dehydration. I literally just sprinted my way here. That's that was the main purpose of this video, really, is just checking out the dam, seeing how it looks. Not really. I mean, if if I did get the the weapon, that would have been a bonus there, but unfortunately not. Lovely. Oh, just a little little shack thing. Cool. This. Oh wow. Oh, there's a recurve bow there. So there you go. If you find this little corner, there's a, a recurve bow, or a loot spawn, I should say. Not a recurve bow, it's, it's not always going to be a recurve bow. Who knows, it might, I don't, I don't think so. But yeah, that's a loot spawn there, in case you didn't know. But anyway, this looks like a nice place to, to log off, really. Log off? Well, end the video, I guess. But, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video showing the Misty Peak Dam. I will be back with, with some more gameplay of something before Grand Theft Auto 5 comes out and then it's it's going to be Grand Theft Auto 5 first person PC goodness for a bit hopefully you'll enjoy it but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video anyway and I will see you next time